The problems with Russia keep piling up. On Tuesday, Moscow announcing the arrest of another American on spy charges. They say the 33-year-old Los Angeles resident was caught raising funds for Ukraine's military. She's now been detained on suspicion of treason. It came just days after the death of opposition leader Alexei Navalny in a remote Arctic prison. Since his death was announced, his mother has been trying to recover his body. And on Tuesday, she issued a new plea to Russian President Vladimir Putin. I'm turning to you, Vladimir Putin. The solution to the issue depends only on you. Let me finally see my son so that I can bury him humanely. The diplomatic fallout is still intensifying. Both Europe and the U.S. say they're now considering new sanctions to punish Putin for Navalny's death. And President Biden is also calling for more action from lawmakers on Capitol Hill. They're making a big mistake not responding. Look, the way they're walking away from the threat of Russia is shocking. Meanwhile, the crackdown on dissent continues. Hundreds of Navalny's supporters have been arrested in the past few days, with some claiming Putin is now scared of the opposition could be getting stronger. He was feared of Alexei Navalny because Navalny was a person who knew how to, uh, how to inspire people. That's why so many thousands and millions of Russians now are mourning his uh, death. Also Tuesday, a Moscow court rejected the latest appeal of jailed American reporter Evan Gershkovich. The U.S. ambassador will visit him tomorrow to discuss next steps. In London, Alex Hogan, Fox News.